Lemur on the loose. That is what the Springfield Police Department dealt with during a call overnight. Elizabeth Van Mitri spoke with the woman who made the 911 call and has some details on why if you've been inspired to get a lemur yourself, you should think twice. Elizabeth. Yeah, Lee, right now I'm on Kimbrough and Woodland. This is where Becky Sellers says that she and her 15 year old son saw the lemur. And this is the area where the Springfield Police Department was able to capture that lemur after what they call a short foot pursuit. Now, the department shared this photo right here on Facebook page. You can see the two officers with the lemur wrapped in a towel. Also, check out some of these photos from Becky Sellers, who says seeing a lemur out of the zoo was a big surprise. She said she knew right away it was someone's pet. Came to the four-way stop, and there was a lemur on someone's hood of their car. So we just sat there and waited just to see, you know, what was happening. And it actually approached us. My son had his window down, and it approached us. It came in the car and hung out for a little bit. It was trying to get in my purse. Now, the lemur has been reunited with its owner, but something important to know and something that animal control wants you to keep in mind is that exotic animals aren't allowed inside of Springfield city limits. So if you're thinking about getting one to snuggle for yourself, think again. Reporting in Springfield, Elizabeth Van Mitri, back to you.